Hello everyone, my name is Siddesh and welcome to Learn Dax channel. In this video, I am going to discuss the different use cases for max, max x and max a function. So in the first example, we want to find the maximum list price from the product table. Now in this case, we can either go for the max function or the max x function or the max a function and each of them are going to return us the same value which is 3578. So in this use case scenario, we can go for either of the three functions max or max x or max a. Now let's move on to the second use case scenario in which we want to find the maximum string value. So we see that the first two functions which is max and max s are returning us the maximum string value in the sales territory table and the column is region. Whereas when we are trying to implement the same using the max a function, we are getting zero as the value. So in this example, we can understand that if you want to find the maximum value of a string, we should either go for max or the max a function. Now let's move on to the third case scenario, which is to find the maximum date. So it is pretty evident that either of the three, which is max, max x or max a give us the same value which is 30th of June and 2021. So if you want to find the maximum date, all the three functions work alike. Now let's move on to the fourth case scenario. Let's say I want to find the maximum product list price for a certain product color, which is black in this case. So this is a table and an expression. We are filtering the product table based on the color black. And then we are finding the maximum product list price. Since max x is an iterator function which in which accepts two arguments which is a table and an expression such kind of calculations can only be achieved using max x function and we cannot use max or max a to achieve this output. There is another use case scenario for max a function in which max a will give us true or false or boolean output based on the input. I will be discussing that in the next video. Until then, thanks for watching. Please share this video with your friend if you find this helpful. Happy learning.